The Pakistan Aeronautical Complex PAC Urdu, Pakistan Aeronautical Complex is a Pakistani aerospace, defense, aviation contractor, and military corporation producing aerial systems for both military and civilian usage, situated in Kamra, Atak district, founded in 1971 by the Pakistan Air Force PAF, the PAC designs, develops, and build aircraft and avionics systems for the inter-services of the country, it also provides its services for civilian aircraft. In addition, the PAC performs local maintenance and works on the aircraft MLU systems of foreign-built military and civilian aircraft. It is solely owned by the Pakistan Air Force as its corporate interests and its corporate appointments are directly made by the Chief of Air Staff from the Air HQ of the Pakistan Air Force, mainly focusing on avionics, aviation, and high tech electronics. The PAC also manufactures military systems for the Pakistan Army and Navy, which are listed as valued customers. Many of these products are specially suited for the Pakistan Armed Forces needs, while others are also marketed to foreign militaries. While it collaborated with several countries' corporate organizations, the PAC often jointly works with the Turkish Thai and the Chinese CATIC. Its aircraft have been exported to Nigeria, Qatar, Saudi Arabia and the United Arab Emirates. Topic operations Since 1947, the Pakistan Air Force operated largely dependent on foreign suppliers, fighter jets and aircraft had to be sent abroad for desired inspection, development, and to produce parts to maintain the fighter aircraft in service, causing the downsizing of the Air Force. After consultation from the PAF's commanders at AHQ at the Pindi Kant and assistance from the Chinese government, the Pakistan Aeronautical Complex PAC was established in 1973 in Kamra with aircraft rebuild factory first being functional. PAC was established by the Pakistan Air Force PAF as part of the new defense policy introduced in 1972. The PAC represents wide range of corporate revenue of the Air Force while fulfilling the national security needs of the country. The Pakistan Aeronautical Complex started with three main Ministry of Defense projects designated P-721, P-741 and P-751. The first two digits show the year of project approval and launch, the third digit is a serial designator. Since 1980s to 90s, PAC functions include licensed built Mirage 3, Mirage 5, and the F 16s, as well as building the F 100 engines for the F 16s under license from Pratt and Whitney. Topic: Aircraft Rebuild Factory. Aircraft Rebuild Factory (ARF), formerly known as F-6 Rebuild Factory (F-6RF) and P-721, is primarily dedicated to the overhaul and parts manufacture of Chinese aircraft in service with the Pakistan Air Force (PAF). The factory is capable of overhauling and parts manufacturing for the Shenyang F-6 now retired by the PAF, Nanchang A-5 also retired by the PAF and F-7 combat aircraft, as well as the Shenyang FT-5 and FT-6 jet trainer aircraft. ARF is also capable of manufacturing drop tanks and harnesses of aircraft.
Topic Mirage Rebuild Factory The Mirage Rebuild Factory MRF, formerly known as P741, is dedicated to the overhaul of French origin military aircraft in service with the Pakistan Air Force PAF, the Dassault Mirage 3 and Mirage V combat aircraft. Overhaul and manufacturing services were used by other countries with French Mirage aircraft in service. The Mirage 3 and a Mirage 5 are under license and built at the PAC factory. This factory also grew to service and overhaul the Pratt & Whitney F-100 turbofan engines belonging to the F-16 Fighting Falcon combat aircraft of the PAF. Due to lack of budget for replacing outdated aircraft, the MRF was devoted to domestically overhauling them, which according to claims, saved the country billions of dollars. Aircraft Manufacturing Factory Aircraft Manufacturing Factory AMF, formerly known as P-751, is dedicated to heavy military aircraft manufacturing. The MFI-17 Mushak basic trainer aircraft built under license for use by the Pakistan Air Force PAF and Pakistan Army Aviation Wing. This factory project managed the aircraft modification and development venture that resulted in the MFI-395 Super Mushak Basic Trainer, based on the MFI-17 Mushak. Development of the K-8 Karakoram also known as Hongdu JL-8 Intermediate, Advanced Jet Trainer was done in cooperation with Hongdu Aviation Industry Group of China, with AMF manufacturing parts for the aircraft. The JF-17 Multi-Role Combat Aircraft also known as FC-1, a joint project between China and Pakistan, is now being manufactured by AMF. The MFI-17, MFI-395, K-8 and JF-17 are now in service with the PAF. AMF also designs and manufactures unmanned aerial vehicles for uses such as target practice. Manufacture of sub-assemblies for the JF-17 lightweight multi-role fighter began on the 22nd of January 2008, while serial production of the fighter began on the 30th of June 2009. On 20 August 2009 the PAF announced that it would begin production of its own unmanned aerial vehicles in collaboration with Italian company Celex Galileo. Production of the UAV, named Falco, was to begin soon. An earlier opportunity to manufacture a fighter aircraft was lost when the Pakistan Air Force abandoned Project Sabre II in 1987, a joint effort by Pakistan, China and Grumman Aerospace that would have seen AMF manufacturing a re-designed Chengdu F-7 variant. Topic Avionics Production Factory APF Avionics Production Factory APF, formerly known as Camera Avionics and Radar Factory KARF, was initiated as Radar Maintenance Center RMC in 1983 to overhaul and rebuild ground-based radar systems. In 1989, RMC was expanded to become Camera Radar and Avionics Factory KARF. APF has the facilities to assemble and overhaul airborne as well as ground-based radar systems, electronics and avionics. 
currently the only ISO 9002 certified facility among PAC. The factory was involved in upgrading the Pakistan Air Force PAF Chengdu F-7P interceptor fleet by replacing the original Italian-built FIAR Griffo 7 radar with the more capable FIAR Griffo 7 MK2 radar, which was assembled under license by APF. More recently, radar production involved the license assembly of the latest upgrade variant of the FIAR Griffo 7, the Griffo 7 MG radar, which arms the Chengdu F 7 PG combat aircraft of the PAF. In mid 2009, it was reported that APF personnel had completed training on printed circuit board assembly machines supplied by U.S. company APS Novastar, which would be used to make circuit boards for combat aircraft avionics. As PAC's capabilities become competitive in the region, commercial ventures from national and international companies are also being undertaken. Topic Project AZM. On the 7th of July 2017, the Pakistan Air Force announced the development of a fifth-generation fighter, a medium-altitude long-endurance unmanned aerial vehicle, male UAV, and munitions under the banner of Project AZM, Resolve or Determination. Air Chief Marshal Suhil Aman stated that the design phase for the male UAV was in its final stages. Topic: Products. Topic: Aircraft. CAC, PAC JF-17 Thunder, co-produced with China K-8 Karakoram, licensed copy of Hongdu JL-8 PAC MFI-17 Mushak, licensed and improved copy of Saab Safari PAC Super Mushak, upgraded variant MFI-17 Mushak Topic: Unmanned Aerial Vehicles (UAV). Abibil Aerial Drone, a small arms target designed for target practice use by operators of small arms machine guns. Also used to train operators for the larger and faster Baz Aerial Drone. Can be very effective for recce missions. Baz Aerial Drone, a recoverable aerial target designed for use with air defense guns and surface-to-air missile SAM systems. It has a very high rate of accuracy. Celex Galileo Falco, a surveillance UAV, production began in August 2009. Consumer electronics The PAC also builds Android tablets PAC Pad 1 and PAC Pad Talk T7. The PAC E Book 1, The PAC N Book 1. Topic. Services Aircraft Engine overhaul Radar overhaul Component overhaul